Hello, my Choo Choo family. I'm your fun-loving happy vlogger, Tom Choo Choo. This is the third time. You're getting used I'm to getting it. Getting a right? little more used to it. <laughs> yeah. See. Awesome. Today, I'm eating keto mukbang again with sandy cheeks. Hi. We're eating just <laughs> chicken wings, and we were debating. Lots of wings. These are chicken wings, but these so many. are also chicken wings. Shut up. She just didn't believe it. I know they are. I just think these are the actual like tra traditional wings. When you ask for wings and you get these, you get angry. <laughs> <laughs> People I, are looking for those. But there's more them. meat in those. Yeah, but those aren't wings. Those are mini chicken legs. <laughs> <laughs> we got 35 of them. I don't think we're going to finish There's 35 yet. total? Yeah, there's 35 total. So let's dig in. But before we dig in, oh, please God. like and subscribe to this channel, okay? We will be doing more muck buns. And for now, that's muck. Let's muck? Yeah. Ew. <laughs> if you guys have not checked muck. out another uh, muck bun channel, it's called the Muck Bros. And then he always say, that's muck. So what are we? We are choo choo. <laughs> <laughs> Let's eat. We, we are definitely not. I am hungry though. The flavors are this is basil and garlic, and this is uh, basil and garlic with a little bit of sesame oil. This one is black sesame with Cholula and a barbecue. Oh. Yeah. You can smell this I don't, okay. black sesame now. I don't. Well, I don't, or we'll, we'll pepper and salt, whatever. Mm. Okay, I'm going to use my left hand. Because I'm in your way. Ah, I wish oh. I was <laughs> Tell them what we're doing because I want to know too. <laughs> Let me eat a bird. This you is my started bird without me. Yeah, me too. Ow. Wait. You're eating with your hand and I'm eating with chopstick? Oh, okay. I told you I was. Mmm. You like it? <laughs> I really like it. Fine, I'll use my hands. Although, I'm going to use my phone later because today I am going to ask my straight sister all these gay slangs, gay terminology. Wait, so you're <laughs> asking me what terms mean? Yes. Okay. Like, it's pretty simple, right? If we talk about, uh, do you know the term gay? Yes. Do you know the term trans? Okay, I do, but yeah, okay. I um, know what you mean now. Do you know the term uh, LGBT? Yeah. Yeah, so so those are terms, but it gets harder. I'm nervous. <laughs> I don't like not knowing things. Mm. It's okay. We should have like drink shots for you. Every time when you fail or you got it wrong, you have to drink a shot. What do you guys think? Leave a comment down below and tell me if that would be a fun game with my sister. I'm glad you thought of it too late for today. It's okay. Okay. Mm. This is so good. Isn't it? Mm -hmm. I'm actually a good cook. Okay, I'm going to try the, the other one. This one doesn't have too much flavor, but whatever. Mm. Oh, good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm glad. I'm just going to use my hand with the broccoli, okay? Mmm. Mmm. What? Okay. <laughs> How should we start this? Do you want to go from easy to hard? Yeah. Okay. I'm nervous. Just a disclaimer. Great. Some of the terms I have searched online and maybe they're not the real meaning of those words, so don't sue me. Okay? Because they're slain, right? So people, yeah. it's, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's go with something that's popular and that's like. Are these appropriate? It's PG 13. How about that? Oh, okay. But I don't know. <laughs> because some of the terms are just too funny that I thought it would be fun to ask you. Oh my god. Okay. I haven't seen any of these, by the way. Yeah. I haven't seen any of the terms, so I have no idea. Yeah. Okay. What's about to happen? We might have to cut a lot of this. Let's go with something easy. Do you know what the term lipsticks 
is. Oh, I don't like this game. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, all right. If that considered as a medium level, then let's do um, cisgender. Wait, I want to know what. I'll I'll tell you later. That sounds sexual. I'll ask you again. Cisgender? No, lipstick. Mm -mm. It's not sexual. No, it's a gay term that people use quite often, actually. Can you use it in a sentence? <laughs> <laughs> you dress more like a lipstick than a butch. Like them? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay. I gave it away. Okay. Yeah, you did. <laughs> I already told her, like you know what butch is. So no, but the way you worded okay. it, I just assumed. But you know what butch is. It's opposite of femme, right? I'm mm -hmm. assuming mass. Yep. But you didn't know. I was shocking. No, it sounded sexual. Ah. Use it in your sentence. <laughs> what does it sound no, sexual? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Next. This gender. Cis. Mm hmm. C I S G E N D E R. Why do I sound like I'm in a spelling bee? I know. <laughs> like, like unidentified, right? Like. No. You used mm. it in a sentence. Do I want to give it away? Mm. Don't give it away. Just use it in a sentence that doesn't give it away. I can see that she's a uh, gender. So. Going from female to male? Mm -mm. I don't know. It's the opposite of transgender. So it's someone, if you are female and you identify yourself as female, mm -hmm. you are a cisgender. When you, whereas a transgender is you identify yourself as the opposite sex. The opposite sex. Mm -hmm. So cisgender, it's. It's what you yeah what you are what you born with and what you identify yourself. So how do you as. use it? Like I am. You are a cisgender. And you are. A cisgender. Cause I. God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> I hate this game. <laughs> okay, let's do some giveaways. Do you know what top and bottoms are? Oh God. Do you know what a power button? <laughs> A what? A power bottom. A power button? Bottom. <laughs> Not a button. No. Bottom. Bottom. A power bottom. Mm -hmm. Do I want to know <laughs> what a power bottom is? What? A power bottom? Mm -hmm. Someone who's really good on the bottom? <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's what I was thinking before. But no. A power bottom. Mm hmm. Big booty Judy. <laughs> <laughs> they got no. big bottoms. Mm -mm. So it has nothing to do with farting. <laughs> <laughs> no. I did not know my straight sister is. Oh, that what? straight? <laughs> no, I mean, you don't know that too much of uh, I gay don't. terms. You don't have gay friends? Not closely. Oh. Oh. I just thought like you have a lot of gay friends around. How do you how does someone look like they have a lot of gay friends? I don't know, but power bottoms is just the dominant bottom. Like when they're in bed, they're very dominant. They want to be in control. I was kind of my first guess was the closest. Yeah. So okay. Oh duh. Okay. God damn it. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Let it out. It's only gonna get crazier. <laughs> these are so easy, by the way. I don't know if. Do you guys know these? Because yeah. I didn't know these. Do you guys know? Okay. It's obvious to you. Do you know what a fag hag is? I don't even want to offend anyone. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to guess that. A what? A fag hag. Yes, I said it. <laughs> I'll just be quiet here. <laughs> no, you don't know what that is. No. Is it obvious? That's one of the first term I learned when I turned, I mean, not turned, when I came out from the closet. Is it, is it an insult? No. Can you use it in a sentence? I've never heard of these. I have a lot of bag hacks. Gay friends. 
a straight female who has a lot of gay friends. Or uh, a street or straight? Straight. Straight female who circle who around. Who has a lot of gay, gay friends. friends. Yeah. So the term doesn't mean gay friend. No. It means a female who has yeah. a lot of gay friends. Yeah. So you thought I was that. Yeah. I thought you would be a fag hag for a lot uh, of gays. Why? I don't know. These are hard. These are so. I thought I was coming over to eat. <laughs> you guys uh, should rate the difficulty level of these. Yeah, you should rate. Okay. Let's do some popular terms. Yes. You know what that means? It doesn't mean anything. You're just like enthusiastic. You're just like, hell yeah. Yeah, but it's from... Um, it just... It's a gay term. Yeah. Like a oh. gay terminology, yeah. And become very popular and people it's use it. It's not a gay term. Just it's. It, I feel like it maybe it's originated expression. from... Yeah. yeah. I think it's probably like Lupo Drag Race or something. Okay, well, you got one right. <coughs> huh? <laughs> okay, this one might be easy for you. No, it's not. <laughs> Bussy. <laughs> B-U-S-S-Y. Bussy. <laughs> I have never heard this term. I can't until hang out like... today because I'm bussy. <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> I don't even know if it's like a verb or a noun. <laughs> what in the world? She does have a boozy. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? It's boy pussy. I was gonna, that's what I... But boy pussy is... I said male genitals. But it's a-hole. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if you are a -hole. Wait, what? Oh. Yeah. Okay, let's do something fun. Oh boy. Kiki. Do you love me? <laughs> no. There's a song called Sister Sisters. So they sing, let's have a kiki. That's all right. A party? To sing. A gay oh, party? Yeah. Well, when you say that, it would give it away. Oh, okay. But I wouldn't know without any context because yeah. I've never heard of it. Kiki is a gay term that people use for like gay parties and Ooh. Or like, there are times that people would just spill the teas. You know what spill the tea is, right? Okay, yeah. Or like gossip and stuff. I'm over this. <laughs> <laughs> the disrespect. <laughs> All right. Let's get a little bit harder. Do you listen to girls in red? Do you listen to girls in red? Mm -hmm. Do you listen to? Fine. Do you listen to girl in red? That's some artists I don't know about? No. It's just kind of a slang that people use, especially in the bar. I'll give you a hint. Do you listen? Lesbian. Lesbians? Lesbians. 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 Lesbians will, will say something like that. Do I listen to girls that are <laughs> Do you listen to girls I don't know what that means. That means... Um, are you... Lesbian? Yeah. So at the bar, someone, if they don't know if you're straight or gay, they'll ask oh. you, do you listen to girls in red? It's yeah. like a, like a little, like, keyword. Like, like a, a code. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I wish we had some of those, like, <laughs> when you don't want to talk to a guy. Mm -hmm. Okay, never mind. And $9 bill. Not that attractive. <laughs> She's not a 10. She's a $9 bill. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a 10, so mm. I'm assuming not very attractive. Tall. <laughs> attractive. It's a term that people use it that, oh, it he's to... definitely gay. So when you saw someone. Oh, so the opposite of that. Mm -hmm. Dang it. But it's more of a description of someone. Like if someone's like walking around and you say, like, is he straight or gay? And then you'd be like. Oh, he's definitely a nine dollar bill. Why nine? Mm -hmm. Do you use these words that you're telling me right now? Uh, I know of them, but I don't talk about them. Like I wouldn't be using. Do you listen to girls in red? <laughs> <laughs> uh, even though I'm not a lesbian. Okay, we got Kiki. Then let's do Kai Kai. <laughs> okay, so it's similar. In a way. Mm, I'll give their hint. No. 
Not at all. Then you shouldn't have said that. <laughs> no. Use it in a sentence. Because people have been mistaken, like using them oh. incorrectly. Yeah. Like interchangeably. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Hmm. These chickens are. Really well, tell good. me. Kai Kai is when two drag queens having sex. <laughs> They're doing some kai kai over there. Why kai kai? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Wow, these are really slang. Yeah. Okay, this term is not only used in gay community communities, but um, YDFC. Oh, it doesn't start with you. Mm -mm. It doesn't start with you. <laughs> no. Like any variation of you, like your no, no? yesterday. No, you're joking. It doesn't start with you, no. but it's a Y. Mm -hmm. Young. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Y D F C. Yeah. Y D F C. Young, dumb. Well, not oh. dumb. Yeah. 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 Young, dumb. Okay, you're too slow. Young, dumb, full of dumb. I was gonna say you don't fucking come. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's actually pretty good. But no. Okay, next we have no tea, no shade. Oh, dang it! I I've heard this before. It's like you're not ashamed of what you're gonna say. Like mm -hmm. you're 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 not drama, but like you're the tea. You know, like yeah. gossip. Mm -hmm. But it's like you're not ashamed of it. Yeah, it's, it's like, like it is what it is. Like yeah. I'm putting it out yeah. there. Am I right? Gag. <laughs> <laughs> It's a form of expression, I think. Is it a form of expression that we want to discuss? <laughs> no, uh, you're talking about SM, right? Yeah, kind of. No. It's it's just a form of expression where you feel like... Instead like of saying, barf. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah so, so it is. Okay. But gag is more like, Oh my god, these foods are so good. I'm gag. Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> <laughs> it's almost like you're so, so, so impressed or whatever, and you're like <gasps> running out of words. You're gag. <laughs> I'm running. I'm, I'm, I'm a little gag. Young people use all these terms. Honestly, I have no idea. Do you use these words? No, but I've seen them. Heard. No, I've seen them, on text. <laughs> No. <laughs> How many do you have? I have a lot. I have one, two, three. I'm not gonna count. Probably twelve already. I meant terms. Oh. <laughs> okay, keep going. Yeah. But what's your body count? Excuse me? <laughs> <laughs> Why? Do you know what that means? Yeah. When someone asks you? Yeah. Okay. How many bodies you've killed? I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> How many people you've slept with? Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Mm. I say body count and my friends are always like, that sounds so scary and dark. Because it sounds like people you've killed, like slaughtered. What is your body count? <laughs> it's, um, I don't know. I don't count. I'm oh. bad at math. <laughs> okay. Gold star gay. Gold star gay. Mm -hmm. He must be really gay. You get a gold star because you're so gay. <laughs> no. Mm -mm. Am I close? No. I need clues. I am not a gold star boy. A gay. Femme? Mm -mm. Do you guys know? If you don't know, still smash Yo, that like help. button. I wish this was live so I can get some help. I know. We should do live next You're time. You're stressing me out. It's a, a gay guy who never had sex with a woman. Oh! Gold star gay. I would have never gotten that. <laughs> Yo, you said this was going to be a lot. We're doing pretty well. You're doing really well. MPNC. No problem. Not coming. <laughs> oh, that's <was> funny. <laughs> I think we should do a lot more. Abbreviation. Yeah, abbreviation you come sorry, funny. <laughs> NP, it's not it's not no problem. No. Never? No. Nice people. No. 
The profile they say is NT MPNC. The first word is not not. It's not no. It is not. No. Mm -hmm. Private pussy. Parts. <laughs> <laughs> MPNC. No picture. No chat. <laughs> That's like no pecs, no sex. Mm -hmm. No curls, no girls. Stone butch. I love this term. I never heard of it, but I love this term. Stone butch. Is it sexual? Yes. It is sexual. No, it's a person. A, a type. How is it sexual? Because it involves something sexual. So it involves their private. Mm-hmm. Someone's but type. It's, but Someone it, who. <laughs> yeah, but it's more of a type, like a femme or. Femme. A butch. And it has nothing to do with. I mean, I think it's more of a. Dominant. Uh, butch is more like a le lesbian term, like more masculine lesbian. Oh. Yeah. So stone butch is. Is this supposed to be obvious now? Because I'm still lost. <laughs> Is it obvious now? I already explained the second half of the term. So it's more of a, a woman who likes to give, but doesn't like to receive. Oh. Mm-hmm. Stone butch. How was that? How would I have gotten that? <laughs> Is what I want to know. Lucky Pierre. Pierre. P-I-E-R-R-E. Pierre, right? Lucky Sounds Pierre. Sounds like a drink. Yeah. I need con some contacts. Oh, I got a Lucky Pierre the other day. It was amazing. Does that mean they named their junk Pierre? No. So Pierre didn't get Lucky. I think it's more of a position. <laughs> what do you guys think? Please leave a comment. Oh no, don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> But also subscribe my channel. It's when a guy, mm -hmm. almost like a sandwich in between. In between what? Two guys when they're having sex. So, so what's the person, no, the, the, the person. The middle one is Lucky Pierre. Yeah. Oh. Like you get the front and you get the back. Oh. Damn, Pierre. <laughs> you are so lucky. <laughs> okay, those are the terms I have for today. I think I got like three, maybe four. Yeah. Max out of what, 20? Jeez. Yeah. Um, that was difficult. Really? Yes. Okay, it was kind of difficult. I mean, I wouldn't be able to guess some of those. And he's sitting over here like, these are obvious. <laughs> Please. What term did you like the most out of all? What of did these? you guys learn? Because I learned a lot. I learned a lot. Yeah. Please leave a comment down below and tell us why nine dollar bills. Right? So weird. Okay. I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs> so what's your body count? Mm -hmm. I think my body count is like. Uh, we're gonna edit this out, okay? Um, Wait, no, you should have edited the best, my answer too. <laughs> Hello, not just now. <laughs> I guess like. Wow, well, you're also ten years older than me. Yes, yes, I did have experience, okay?